Hey to all my followers, this is your girl, Foxy Wilma, aka Wilma Young, on my YouTube channel. Well, big things have been happening for me this 2016 so far, and I have a big reveal for y'all, but I'm going to wait off on that reveal and everything. I'm going to do that tomorrow, sometime tomorrow before I go to work, of course, and, and everything, because right now i got a lot of stuff going on, about to go out to this um, group meeting and everything. Around about um, six and stuff. So um, this video isn't about my big reveal that I said that I was going to reveal on my um, my Facebook profile sometime today. So I'm pushing it back until tomorrow because what I have to reveal, um, I have to give it adequate time and I have to do it justice and everything. But this video is about the situation I had this morning when I went to go put gas into my aunt's Ford F-150 pickup, which is a V8. And the reason why I was going to the gas station to put gas in it is because I was going to, like, you know, um, need a couple of gallons of gas in it and everything. Because that truck sucks up some gas. It sucks up some gas. So, anyway, I'm out of the gas station and everything. And I use my debit card. Because my debit card is, like, very convenient to me and everything. So, with that being said, I rarely carry any cash, like... If I have cash on me, it's like you know, a couple of dollars and some change and everything. Because the majority of my funds are in my account. And so my debit card is just convenient to where I can just swipe and, you know, go and everything. Well, situation happened this morning <laughs> where um my second card wasn't working. And I was like, I was like, I'm just going to say, I was like, what the fuck? Like, what the fuck is going on with this shit right here and everything? Like, I know I got money in my in my account and everything. Like, I know I got money in my account because I just used the card yesterday and the card was working fine when I, when I withdrawed a good amount of money out of my account yesterday. So, I'm like, what the hell is going on? Because the thing, the card, the machine was saying, like, go see the cashier and everything. So, before I went to go see the cashier, I went on my phone and everything like that. And went on, like, you know, my bank mobile app and everything. And then checked to see if my phone's still in my account. Because I was like, did someone steal my identity? Someone seize my money? What the hell's going on? And everything. So, I checked my account. And sure enough, my money is dead. My money is dead. So, I'm like, okay. What the hell's going on with this with this debit card right here? Something's going on with it and anything. And it's causing me an inconvenience at this particular moment in time. Anything. Because I was in the mode of like using my aunt's pickup truck to go over to my father's place and like, you know, get the rest of my stuff out of there because I'm in the process of moving and anything. So that's what I was doing. And I was going to like put $10 a Ten dollars worth of gas in her pickup truck and anything, cause I, like I just said, the truck be like just sucking up gas just like that, cause it's a V8 and everything. So I'm going to the gas station and everything, and then I tell the lady like, you know, um, it's saying for me to come in here, blah 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 and everything. And so she's like, okay, like you know, like she she runs my car and everything, and it still doesn't work, still doesn't work. It's saying like you know, transaction didn't go through, didn't go through, transaction isn't working and everything. And so she was like, you know, call call your bank, and I was like, I am gonna call my bank and everything. So I left my bag there and I came back to my aunt's house, got on the phone with my bank. And, mm, excuse me, everybody in their mama was calling the bank that I bank with. Everybody in their mama, because it seemed probably the same thing was going on with them and everything. And they were trying to figure out what the fuck is going on and stuff. So, it took about 30 to 40 minutes to talk to a customer service rep and anything. And I was calm. I told myself to stay calm and everything. Like, you know, just see what's going on with the situation and stuff. And so... When someone got on the phone and I, I told him like, you know, when they when someone got on the phone they'd be like, How can I help you, um, Miss Charlene Young? I was like, um, I just wanna know um what's going on with my debit card. And he'd be like, What's going on with this and stuff? And so they went on to say that, you know, the majority of their calls have been about like, you know, debit cards not, you know, like working, basically not making a transaction and everything. And they said it wasn't on day end, it was on visas in. Somebody at Visa had, as they say, dropped the ball. Somebody had dropped the ball and anything. So I was like, mm, okay. And I, that, I literally said that to the customer service rep. I was like, I was like, so you tell me someone at Visa dropped the ball 
and then they didn't they kind of didn't respond or whatever. They was like, they was like, yeah, well, it's coming. It's you know the problem, the issue is on visas end and everything. And I was like, hmm. I said, oh, I said, hmm. Okay, okay. And then he said, and so the the customer service rep told me that if I wanted to like you know get funds out or whatever, I would have to go to an ATM machine. I was like, then I started thinking to myself like, okay, where's the nearest ATM machine? Okay, that's a little bit going out my way and anything, but if it had to be done, it had to be done. And then I mentally said to myself, from here on out, from here on out, I will make sure I have me more than a couple of dollars on me in case this bullshit happened again and anything. Because basically what it is, is like an inconvenience, inconvenience, ah, I can't even say the word. It, it's an inconvenience, inconvenience, yeah, inconvenience. Yeah, I think that's the right word to use. It's, well, let's just say it put a it puts a monkey wrench. I'll say it puts a monkey wrench in what you were trying to do at the particular moment in time and anything. You just gotta go another way about doing it and stuff. So I was like, I was like, okay, then if I gotta go to ATM, I gotta go to ATM. So um, next thing I know, you know, I um think one of my friend, I think I called a friend and um. Good close friend and everything. And we talked for probably an hour and stuff like that. And then I decided, okay, let me go see if this car works now. So went back out to the gas station. Put the car in the car reader and everything. And thank God motherfucking shit worked this time and stuff. But I told myself from here on out, when I get paid, I will make sure I take me out a couple of dollars in case this bullshit happens, happens again. Because I was like... That kind of like, you know, put a monkey wrench in, like, you know, things I was trying to do at that particular moment in time. I got them done, but it feel like, you know, I'm rushing through the rest of my day and everything. For like, you know, having that 40, that 30 to 40 minutes waiting on the phone to talk to someone to find out what was going on. Oh, shit. Shit. That's what I say. Shit. Because like, it's like this. When your shit don't work. When your shit don't work, you're like looking around like what the fuck is going on and anything. And then everybody and their mama's on the phone and stuff trying to figure out what's going on. And so, I mean, like the debit card is convenient. It is convenient. But best believe me, your girl is going to have a couple of dollars on her just in case some bullshit like that happens again. Because that was the first time I ran into some shit like that. So, with that being said, my followers, my supporters, and my fans... Um, big things are happening for your girl, Wilma Young, a.k.a. Foxy Wilma. So, um, stay continued to my mini journeys because what I got to reveal tomorrow is a big step in, like, you know, things that I've been dreaming about, dreaming about for years and everything. So, when I make that reveal tomorrow, I'm going to give it justice and everything. So, with that, as always, have a good day. Bye.